Thunder here, and uh, first of all, sorry for the lack of videos. Uh, life is a little bit complicated right now, so um, I have a lot of stuff filmed, but I just have to edit everything, and I really don't, I'm, I'm really not having time to do it. But I promise very soon you guys will see new videos up on the channel. So today I decided to do a quick video that I don't need to edit or anything a Loxy review. And this time, instead of reviewing just one from one set, I'm reviewing the whole set. This time we'll be reviewing set 10 from the sound, Gashapon Sound Lockseed series. In this set we have um, Lemon Energy and Blood Orange and there is a special blo Blood Orange version uh, metallic one that I didn't get unfortunately. Yeah, let's get into the Lockseeds. So first let's get the easiest one out of the way, um, Blood Orange. It's the same style as the fruit lock seeds, which means uh, it's silver with the black um, back. Um, I just love this color design. It's the same base as orange. I think the button is different though. Um, it's the base same as orange, but um, the, this metallic um, red it's really really well done and I really love this uh, uh, vine kind of thing um, obviously this is not from the series this is from the movie uh, the movie Tyson and um, yeah uh, I have the uh, I don't have the original orange but I do have the the special edition that came with the magazine so you guys can see um, that the mold is pretty much the same it's still Lockseed 07. But yeah, this is Bujin Gimes and this is Gimes. Um, so, as always, button here in the back. If you press it together and open this, that's the kind of switch that you have to pull back. So, um, if you do both at the same time, it goes. It's more of a angry voice that I really like. So, um, in the single coup driver, uh, you would lock on, and when you cut with the knife, it hits this button again. So since I don't have the the, the uh, single coup driver, I'm just gonna pull this button right here. Uh, so let's open it up, and so yeah. So it says blood orange arms, dark uh, the dark path. Uh, on stage. Here you can see the um, the orange lice and here the Dai Dai Maru but with the vines again. So like the other fruit lock seeds and other sound lock seeds, on the third press if you press once, twice or three times it will do the the attack. So let's press it one so once Now, twice. And three times. Okay. Um, there's a fourth sound. If you press it here, is an exclusive sound for this lock seed. Exactly. If you saw the review of the um, pine lock seed um, links are in here, um, you can. It's it, it said uh, on the fourth push, um, Kamen Rider Gaim pine arms, but this time it says Bujin Gaim because it's not Gaim. It's not a Kamen Rider. It's a Bujin from another dimension. So pretty cool. Um, now for the one that requires most explanation. So the energy lock seed in the deluxe version they work very different than this guys. Um, first on the on the paint app um, on the nor on the deluxe version um, everything is with this plastic from the tip and from the button so everything is is kinda clear see-through but since this is a cheap version they opted out for this weird 
blue plastic that I don't like really much. And I don't understand why they use this because um, I do have the Gashapon um, Gaia memories, not with me, but back home. And um, they are all with clear plastic. So I don't, I don't understand why they would not use clear plastics for these guys. Especially since here and here and also here, it's um, it's clear plastic. In the deluxe version, um, as you can see on the normal oxide, here is is plain, but here is should be a button because when you put on the Genesis driver, it pushes this button and opens this part. However, because it's, it's spring loaded. In the Sengoku driver, when you hit with the knife right here, it would also open, but as you saw here, it doesn't. And it's not spring-loaded here too, so it stays like this. So, um, you have to open it manually every time. So, this is kind of a bummer. Um, otherwise, function-wise, it works exactly the same way as the... as these guys have a button and um but it has some some different stuff so it works in both the Sengoku driver and the Genesis driver because they push the same button as well it's just that uh you'll be missing a lot of stuff uh another thing that i forgot to mention um you have speakers here but you also have speakers here in the front this is because it has to be a little louder than the normal ones for a feature that i'll show um in a moment so, um, let's do the the opening one. Uh, the button is the same as the Suica, uh, which is the pressing one here, which is awful when you're trying to uh, hang this on backpacks because they keep opening all the time. But um, let's press the button and open it and see what sounds that it has. So very different. Um, when you put on the the, if you have the, if you buy this one, I I recommend opening it first and then putting on the Genesis on or Sengoku driver, and then locking on and pressing the button, and like doing the soda. So here you have the little silver with the yellow plastic and here you have the uh, fruit uh, no lights of course so um, the energy lock seeds are different from the normal ones um, from the third push on the normal ones you do scash ole and sparking but on this one there's no ole so you push once or twice to, to do the special sound And when you press a second time, it goes, it goes directly to sparking. So there is no ole this time. Uh, there is a fourth sound, and for that I'll go, I'm going to need um, a normal lock seed for that, because it's a mix sound. Uh, in the series, um, Kota gets the special attachment for the belt to do the Jimba Lemon arms. And uh, the fourth sound is this sound, so let's activate uh, Bloody Orange, since we have it here. And now pressing both at the same time. So as you can see, it has a sound. Um, let's play the sound alone. Yeah. That's basically what it does. And it actually mix with a lot of lock seeds. Um, the only one that I found that it didn't mix really well is with this guy. With uh, fresh orange. But um, let's try with... Uh, uh, let's try with uh, Ankh. No.
So you guys can see how it works with the other lock seeds. Um, it's cool. It's cool, but it's really different from the deluxe, um, and uh, there's a lot of features missing. So um, I don't have the, the driver, so th this doesn't bother me that much, except for the this plastic here. Um, but um, if you're trying to go on the cheap and um, wanna do wanna have like good um, energy lock seeds for your Sengoku driver. I really can't recommend this because it's not that great. And uh, also, um, like, to time these, this has to be on the second push and this has to be on the fourth. So if you're putting this on the Sengoku driver with the attachment, you're never going to be able to pull it off. Never. It's a very, very different... Um, mechanism so um, it's cool when you're trying to do like by hand like like I'm doing pushing both buttons at the same time but at the single driver it's not gonna work very well so um, for the bloody orange I say go for it it's dead on it's perfect um, if you are like me and like to go out with these attached to your backpack this one is the coolest. This one is the most badass one you can ever go out with. Aside from orange, orange is also cool, but this is way cooler. This one has some really cool sounds, but um, a lot of features missing. Um, I having to do this manually, it's a, it's a bummer. Um, and there's the other the other three. Um, Cherry and um, Melon Energy are coming out on the next set. Um, they're gonna be like exactly like this one. So, if you really want this, and you don't have a lot of money to expand on the on the Genesis driver, or to get this one um, on the Sonic Arrow, um, I say buy this. But uh, if you want to get Cherry and Peach. Peach is probably gonna come on the twelfth set. Um, if you want to get Peach or or um, Cherry, buy the deluxe versions. Um, you're gonna get a much better lock seed out of this uh, with lights and uh, spring-loaded functions. So yeah, um, this set is one of the coolest ones. Um, I wanted both of them, so I'm happy that I got both of them. And um, as always. Uh, each one is 500 yen, which is like five dollars each. So don't pay more than 12 bucks for for it. Um, it's a steal. Uh, so yeah, that was that was the review for the set number 10 of uh, Lock Seeds. If you like it, like it, comment, subscribe, um, and uh, I see you guys in the next video. I'll promise I'll put up another Exploring Japan um, kind of video next. And uh, yeah, guys, um, thank you for watching, and bye-bye.